part 3. Okay, let's start with the intro. Continue. Uh, this one with the cost using of electrical energy. So the power uh, is the rate of using energy. So the SI unit for power is watt or joules. So the e electrical power is equal to electrical energy used divided with time taken. Second, eh? So the electrical appliances are normally marked with the power and voltage rating. Electrical power is equal to voltage time current okay now <clears throat> the unit commonly used in uh, for electrical energy is kilowatt hour <clears throat> so the cost of electrical energy use is equal to electrical energy use in the unit in the units time with cost per per unit okay let's see what is the cost of using electrical energy <clears throat> so power is equal to electrical energy joules Divided with time used, second. So unit is watt and one kilowatt is equal to uh, 1000 watt. So the cost of using electrical energy, for example, electrical appliances, number one is uh, stand fan. So the voltage is 240 volt and the power for stand fan is 75 watt. So the washing machine is uh, using the same one, uh, 240, uh, except the, the electrical kettle is around 220, 240. But the power uh, for the electrical appliances is different. Okay, varies depends on the type of uh, electrical appliances. For example, the washing machine is 400, juice maker 300 watt. Electrical kettle use 2000 to 2400. Okay, electrical kettle. Huh? So the rice cooker uh, used 650 and the hairdryer used around 500 to 1000. Depends on the, uh, the brand. Okay, next one is uh, the formula. So the relationship between power, voltage, and current. So uh, shown in the formula below. This one is current is equal to power divided to voltage. So when we we also can use uh, the same one but we can change the position of the voltage power depends on the, the need that we need to use. But the principle use this one. Lah. Okay, you you need to understand as the, posi the position of the current, power, and the voltage. Okay, so the electrical appliances, we see the example of the how to calculate the re relationship between power, voltage, and current. So the electrical appliances uh, is 150 watt and the voltage is 250 watt, uh, volt. So calculate the electrical current uh, of the electrical appliance. Okay, so the current is uh, the formula. This one, current is equal to power divided with voltage. So the current is 150 divided with 250. So we will get 0 0.6 amperes. So next one is a, a relationship between electrical energy, power and time. So the, record, uh, the electric energy kilowatt hours equals to power time time time. Okay, hours. Huh? So example, let's see the example. An electrical appliances have power of 1 kilowatt equals to 1000 watt that be used for 5 hours. So the, calculate the electrical energy used. So the e electrical energy is equal to power times hours. So we have 1 times 5. So we have 5 kilowatt hours. So the amount of electrical energy used by the electrical appliances depends on two factors. Number one is power, the power of the electrical appliance. And number two, the duration of electric appliance is being used. One kilowatt is equal to one unit energy. Example, uh, we use this rate. So electrical energy used in unit for the first 200 unit the price rate is 0 0.128 and for next 200 units so 
the price rate is 0 0.258 for the subsequent additional unit so the the price rate is 0 0.278 okay this is an example of the bill so let's see the another example the cost of energy uses as follow okay the calculate uh, the energy cost if 474 units were used. So let's see. So the first 200, what, uh, 43 units and 60 cents. 100, and get 33 and uh, 40 cents. And uh, the balance is 174 times with 0 0.516. So we get 89 ringgit and 78 cents. So the energy cost. Total is 166.78. So, as simple as that. Huh? Okay, the last one will be uh, conserving electrical energy. We need to conserve our electrical energy. Number one is turn off the light when uh, not in use. Uh, number two is use fluorescent lamp which are more efficient in lightning. And number three, iron all your clothes in one time. Number four is keep the, the fridge away from the heating appliances such as oven and do not open it, the fridge door often. And number five, use energy efficient uh, electrical appliances in home and office such as uh, the highest star that you can uh, uh, buy. Star represent the energy efficiency for electrical appliances. Okay. So thank you very much for your time and we will uh, see you again for our next class. Thank you. Bye-bye. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.